Alrighty, welcome on back in. So I want to get right to it because Leanne Miller joining us this morning for her second recipe of the day. She's now showing us to make one of my all time favorites, taco salad. Okay, do you step out of the box for your taco salad or do you just keep it simple? Oh, oh, oh no, I really love to step out of all the boxes. Yay, okay. Like I, and in Amish country, this is a really popular dish because of having such big families around here. So this is going to make a lot. If you don't want your recipe to be this large because taco salad doesn't keep real well, just just divide it in half. Makes sense. Um, do, do a little girl mass. That's what they call it these days. Okay. <laughs> We're going to make some dressing. And I have I have really selected some beautiful things from one of my favorite places in the area of Monarchy Cheese. And one of those things is um, their salsa. They have all kinds of different salsa. They have like chunky salsa, they have corn salsa, they have black bean salsa, they have something called Christmas salsa. Which kind um, are you using? I like the chunky. I'm going to eat, I, I like chunky too, and that's what I have sitting here. Oh, yay. And if I was in the studio, I would, I would take, I would give this to you to take home. Perfect. Um, I'm using the corn because I, I like that. I like yep. the, I like, you know, it's a little different. So I've got a half a cup of sugar and 16 ounces of Thousand Island dressing. I'm going to put about two tablespoons and I'm going to be generous to generous two tablespoons of the corn salsa and then i'm going to put some taco seasoning again um Monarchy cheese does a great job of um of carrying some like cottage industry yeah type brands and this is um milford spice and this is the taco seasoning so i'm going to put a tablespoon See, in the that. dressing so easy even okay and even though i have put a whole pack of taco seasoning in my meat I'm still going to put it in my dressing. Oh, I want, a, yeah, give me some tough of flavor, girl. Yes, yes. Okay. All right. Now we're going to take, this is a pound of ground beef and a half a pound of sausage, bulk sausage. You can do hot sausage if you like a little heat. Um, I like to add the sausage because I just think it gives it a nice, just a nice flavor. I like depth of flavor. Give me some sausage in that taco salad. So now I have kidney beans and okay. baby beans. Ooh. See, that's different. I like that. I, I have, of course, Amish country is known for yes, all put, the yep. meat and cheese and dairy. So I've got some, I've got some beautiful sharp cheddar. And listen, take the extra few minutes to hand shred your cheese. It's worth it. I've got some green onion. Oh, I love and that. And then I've got two cups of grape tomatoes cut in half. And if you want to see a finished bowl, like a finished, beautiful bowl of this sitting on my counter, yeah. you can follow me on Instagram at Leanne Miller. It's just my name, L-E-E-A-N-N -E -E Miller. And then now I'm going to pour this over. My sugar has kind of broken up in that dressing a little bit. I'm going to pour this over. Leah, and that is toss it up. You just like hit the timing mark perfectly because they just said wrap right as you are putting on that beautiful dressing there. I'm hungry from all of these hours away, Leanne. Okay, one more time. I want people at, uh, at home to know where they can find you, these recipes, these, I mean, these beautiful dishes that you're able to put Thank together. Thank you. Thank you so much. Y'all are so kind to me. Just Leanne Miller, at Leanne Miller, L-E-E-A-N-N -E Miller on Instagram or my website, leannemiller.net. Well, whoever is about to eat that is about to have an amazing lunch, and I'm jealous. Thank you, Leanne. <laughs> we appreciate you always.